traders, hello, happy weekend. It is Saturday night, about 20 past uh, 6 in the evening. And I'm just going to give a quick, uh, this is actually how the month has been going so far. It's, well, it is the 19th, so it's coming to the back end of the month now for May. And what I will do is, what I'll show is my, this is the Bollinger Band Live account uh, that I'm running. And let's get this across here. What I am, no, this is my Oanda account. So this is actually the worst account um, in my portfolio currently. So we've got this month is not so pretty. Now I do have the Euro US dollar uh, chugging along not too bad. I mean, that's like 1.4% or so unrealized. So that's not too bad. But uh, even so, you deduct 1.4%. Where did it go? There it is. If you take 1.4 off that, that's still like 4.5%. So not uh, really that great. So we've had some looky loo here. So at USD long, uh, the pound yen was held for, for quite a while, uh, and the Aussie dollar as well. So they were both quick, you know. So I mean, the pain was <laughs> wasn't too bad. Um, but yeah, so that is the, the current situation. So as you can see, you know, really good January, um, February, that was just one trade, I believe I held. No, it wasn't. There was a couple, I think. <clears throat> okay, maybe not. Might have had a winner, break even, and a losing trade, perhaps, or two break. I think it was two break evens and a losing trade because I've risked two percent per trade. This wasn't too bad. This actually went um, pretty well, and then it went back and hit the trailing exit, and same for that as well. So New Zealand actually I moved a bit too soon. Um, look, I mean, let's the pound yen. This was the trade that uh, now on this account um, isn't really faring that well either. But I do pride myself on showing my account, um, you know, accounts whether they be good or bad. Um, I am eyeing off. Uh, the pound short potentially, but yeah, so the pound yen was actually a little bit more risk than I'd like to take. That was because it was quite a wide stop loss. So even 0 0.01 lots was still, um, you know, not great risk management, right? 2% is all that I really want to take. So I had to minimize risk on the Aussie dollar. I could have risked a little bit more, probably 0 0.2 uh, lots for that. And this is the outcome. So two losing trades on the Axie Trader account. This is linked with Axie Select. Um, so I'm hoping to get some capital allocation. So that's, that's that. I've just got the Kiwi up here. A lot going on. I'm trying to link this account, the Axie Trader account to my FX now. Um, I'm just getting the MetaTrader for EA sorted that they provide. So that's that. So, I mean, good month. Nope. But I mean, there's still time left in the month. The pound, you know, to me is a potential short. It ended the, ended Friday, pretty bearish and the week. We'll see. I mean, it is on some support right now, but I'm still going to watch that, guys. So that's probably the pound or the kiwi, the pound more so than the, um, it is sideways for a while, but we'll see. It only takes one move and then there's panic selling. So it's interesting. Uh, not much else to report on. I'll, I'll sh to finish the video, I'll, this is how the euro ended for the day as well. So not too bad. And the week. And that's how it ended for the week. So I got in here. So a little bit of um, pos positivity to uh, <laughs> end the week, but that's trading. The pound yen was a two out of five entry. It was aggressive. Let's go to the pound yen. I mean, I want to talk about that. But I always journal my trades. And there was an element here of you know fear of missing out. I mean, the thing about trading is, you, you know, especially for me, I've got to be picky and respect that. And I didn't really... So, I mean, I sold around here and it bounced up and it just looks like a reversal potentially. So, but uh, those are the trades, guys, that I've had so far. Um, Euro US dollar is still going on the Axie Trader account and the Oanda account, guys. Um, be watching the pound US dollar for potential sell trade and maybe the Kiwi. But that's it, guys. Thanks for watching and bye for now. Happy trading.